Hey guys, does the Pat Pat brand actually fit newborn? Let's find out. Hey guys, this is Brenda from my Wee Wee Bones Cradle. I have a few family members home. It's a long weekend and it's raining and it's cloudy and then it goes sunny. But I still want to do this video. I have two of my older sculpts here. This is Billy Donovan and he is the Ellie Sue sculpt by Bonnie Brown. And this is the Coco Malu sculpt by... Ooh. Eliza Marks, I think, but I named her Arinda Gale. Billy here is a portrait baby of my middle son, Brandon, and he named him Billy Donovan. And Arinda is a family name from, I have my great, 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 great grandmother on my father's side, is was named Arinda and I thought that was such an unusual name and Gail is from my mom. So is a form from my mom. Now these two are newborn size. You can't really tell on camera because she is a slender newborn and he is a thicker newborn. But as for like the size from neck to here is the the same length so if you could see that they are the same length they're say they're wearing newborn both of them and i know that billy is a boy and i don't have i i think i mostly got female like girl pat pat clothes but because i just want to use his body so this particular body is a thicker newborn and I'm going to try the outfits on both babies and see how they look. So I'll just get them down to their bodies. Well, this is back in the day when... Sorry. Um, I lost track. Um, I was going to say this is back in the day when I also used a onesie under their... I mean, it gets really cold in Canada. I was, remember, I remember many people on my channel asking me, why do you put so many clothes on them? But it's cold. <laughs> Where I live in northern Canada. Oh, his hair. It's a bit messy, but he's still a cutie. So right now, the sun is down. Oh. He needs a haircut this is what his body looks like um they were both reborn by wendy of weedy dolls wow that still looks brand new see no stains or nothing and it's been on him for a long long time as you can tell by those diapers getting worn out a bit And this is a Huggies size one, I'm pretty sure. There's a newborn oh, size one. So he has the thicker, the thicker body, but still newborn. Okay, so I guess. I guess he could wear some zero to three, I guess. I don't know, but he is the same length as the Coco Malu. She is a slender newborn. And I'd love to try the same clothes on both of them. Oh, I forgot how cute her legs are. <laughs> so we'll get her undone. Uh, she's kind of falling. I remember 
with this onesie. I had this onesie on. I have an Anastasia kit, and that was her signature onesie back in the day. So she has like the jointed. But see, see, I'll move all this out of the way. Put them. Yeah, she is a lot smaller, but I mean, they're the same length though. Let's see if I <laughs> if I use one of these pat pats. So let's do it at the very top, the bottom. I'm not gonna pull it so it's about it's long. See, same, same length, different bodies, different newborn styles. So, um. I'm not sure what size I'm looking for their so-called newborn so yes this is a newborn and let's see how it will fit this might really bother me this tag I'm just and uh, I don't have my scissors, but I don't want to rip at the, I don't want to risk ripping it and ruining it. So let's just try what this thicker newborn would look like. Dip the sun fiber. <laughs> oh my goodness, I did. I was just worrying about the tag. <sighs> okay. Sorry, you can't see his feet. As soon as I... Oh my goodness. Such a cute outfit. <laughs> so this fits him very well. I'm just doing up the their snaps back here. And then there's a yeah, how do these the ribbons must go like this. So one side, oh my goodness. If he had a bonnet on, he would be so cute. He would be a Belinda. Hey, would you be a Belinda? That okay, wait, move her out of the way. Oh my goodness. Look how cute that is. <laughs> yeah, they go up here. Oh my goodness. So that's a newborn on the Ali Sue sculpt. Fits. It's a tiny tiny bit big, but I mean it's I would rather have it like that. So I'll be back. I'll take this off and then I'll try it on the Coco Malu sculpt. So let's see. And the slender. Slender. I'm not sure if I like these kind anymore, these swivel. I don't know. I mean, I have, I have dolls of both. Like, this guy doesn't. I don't know. I think I like them. I think I'm starting to prefer. 
for non-jointed. Because <laughs> every time her arm just swings back, it's just like... Yeah, it's a little big, but not not overly. And I still have this tag that I don't have scissors. I don't want to ruin the lace, but it looks all right. It looks pretty good on her. Now, what else do I have that is newborn? We'll try one more thing. I can't remember what else. Okay, that's zero three months. I'm pretty sure I remember these are newborn. This one. I left the yellow one downstairs. I'm pretty sure this is newborn. Okay, one more outfit. Of, yes. Newborn. So let's try this one on her, on both. Bend down. Such a cute outfit. Oh, this one does have snaps at the bottom. That's good. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if I like that. There was a time you go through phases when you're collecting. You go through these different phases of what you prefer. And you're just learning. There's so many different varieties on the doll that you just learn to see what you like and what you don't like. And you might have to experience, like, firsthand how you like it. I'm starting not to like. Oh. Color looks awesome on her. Let's see if you can see that. Oh, so yeah, I would say that. Oh, I looks like I have to trim that. And there's a whole line of it. Fix that up a bit. Oh, she looks cute. Now, if she had full arms, I'd like that a lot more. I think it fits her pretty good. And she's a slender newborn. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> That's just cute. Now, if she was, like... Um... Like a, if she was a full vinyl or a, a silicone, I would, yes, newborn is actually fits her well. Let's see what, how it fits Billy. I'm just going to take this and move it down. I think it fits her pretty well, and she's a slender newborn. Let's try it on Billy. 
I'll be back. <laughs> Wild hair Billy. It looks kind of like old fashioned kind of bodies. So wide. Not tapered. Anyways. Let's see how it would look on this size. Thicker newborn. Oh my goodness. This actually fits them. Um, like the waist part that I had. <laughs> It looks so funny wearing this female thing. I know he looked all right in the other one, but this one just looks funny for some reason. <laughs> Aw. But yeah, this, this part. I don't know, it looks better on the Coco Malu. He, he just, he reminds me of a little chub chub. I don't know, this is, looks better on the Coco Malu. I don't know. It's kind of, I don't know, it looks, it's more flattering on the other one. It seems like it's loose, loose, tight. Loose, loose, loose. loose. Like, you know what I mean? He's too wide. Let's see if this guy, the Ellie Sue, can wear a zero to three. Yeah, this just, it doesn't flatter him at all. So, this newborn could look really good on a thin newborn. Like I have the Edie, or Evie by Lorelei Eagles is thin. Um, the Little Treasure is thin. <sighs> He's a thicker newborn. Okay, let's see if I have... I thought I had a zero to three. Is that what this beautiful thing is? Oh, I love this material. This one is a... Zero to three. Okay, so let's try this beautiful zero to three on a thicker newborn like the Ellie Sue. Oh, this hair just keeps messing my things away. Wow. Wow. This fits him. See, I prefer the bigger, the slightly bigger. Wow. A little big on the neck, but not overly big. Try this. Now, but wow. It fits them nicely. Oh, look. Gotta get rid of those tags. Oh, 
That looks so cute. And this is a zero to three size. Oh, the book and camera. Can you see it? I'm doing this really messy. <laughs> Aww. I wish it was sunny in here. Aww. This is just my light. This is zero three size. I think it looks great. So, in my personal opinion, I think the Pat Pat is pretty good. It seems to fit, like the newborn can fit the slender Coco Malu, and the thicker newborns could wear the 03. I don't think there's a problem with the sizes at all. So I'm very happy about that. What do you guys, do you guys have any experience with Pat Pat? I would definitely order from them again, especially at those sale prices. Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching and until next time. Bye guys, thank you for being here.